Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is Rob Dollar back with another vid. Now, before I get into this vid, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. Say, yo, Dollars, we love what you're doing. Make sure if you guys are new to the channel that you guys subscribe. I'm here to talk about the not-so-limited CP3 PEs. Um, Honestly, I think that they did the same thing that they did with the... Uh, with the ones, you know, the seat the the CP3 ones, the play, player exclusives, they were supposed to be real limited. Next thing you know, they became super general. And I'm thinking that's what they're gonna do with these. Because I don't know if this is a Photoshop picture, but this popped up. I don't know if this is Photoshop, made, created, I don't know what it is. But all of a sudden these popped up, a picture of these. So I'm not sure. Let me know if you were able to copy a pair. I know a few people didn't. But I'm seeing pictures like this on Twitter. The most shocking thing about this is that I call my local DTLRs. Every single one of them. And every single one of them had them in stock. They was like, you come in and cop them right now. I was like, what? And usually DTLR be on some bullshit. That, that's like one of the worst sneaker stores in my area locally. I don't even like going over there because they, they give you a bunch of runarounds. So when I called the DTLR today and they told me they in your local DTLR, you could come get them. I was like, what? Are you serious? Me knowing that they was they seemed general to me. I, I was like, man, I'm not wasting my time. Go buy a bulk of these and then get stuck with them. Each of them at $200. And you can't even take them back to DTLR. So I was like, nah, I'm good. But yeah, man, when I heard that they got these sitting on shelves at DTLR, that shit blew my mind. And like I said, by the looks of it, a lot of people were able to cop. I think you can still cop them on Nike. This is right now, 1.41 p.m. Let me see. Oh, maybe you can't. But yeah, man, comment down below. Let me know if you were able to cop these. Were you looking to cop these? Because uh, to me, my opinion, these are nothing like the Ray Allen PEs. And uh, this is this is this was definitely a crazy release. You feel me? So comment down below. Let me know if you feel like these were general. This, this was, to me, in my opinion, as far as what I'm seeing, these were the most general release quick strike sneakers to ever release. These are nowhere close to the... To the uh, to the Ray Allen 13s, and I believe honestly that they're gonna do this, they're gonna give these the same treatment like they did the uh Jordan 1 PEs. Maybe I'm wrong, but that's what it's looking like, especially, especially if this is an official picture. I'm not sure, but that's what it's looking like. You feel me? I think they'll start dropping them these more places later on, and maybe we'll get the home versions too. I don't know, but. This today was a funny release, you feel me? Comment down below, give me your opinions and your thoughts on how you feel about this. Do you think it was general? Do you think they were limited? Comment down below, man. This is Rob Dollar. I'm getting out of here, y'all. Peace.